Hey, what is going on? We made it. It's your boy Rev here, and today we're having a new Halloween special thing, whatever. I'm just going to be telling you about a story, you know? Not really much of a big story, you know, because I'm kind of kind of tired right now. Uh, I'm going to take a shower in a little bit, but yeah, comment down below if you know who I'm dressed like. Not that many people have guessed, but yeah, but um, some people have. And since today is Halloween, I'm going to share a little story time with you for Halloween. And yeah, let's just get right into it. Um, I went trick-or-treating whenever I was in first grade. I was only seven years old. My brother is seven years apart from me, so he was in eighth grade. So, he was 14 at the time. He took me because, you know, he's old enough to do his own decisions at, at this point. But he wanted to go to a party. So what happened was... I couldn't be left alone with any of my sisters, so I went to the party with my brother. It was kind of stupid, but that's the way it had to be. So it turns out, what happened was, my brother was getting into an argument with this one guy, and he was just facing off at him, he was like getting up in his face about it, and then that's whenever I came in, I was like, wait, what's going on here? And the guy said, do you know this tool? And he's like, yeah, it's my little brother, what do you have to say about that? And then he says, well, I don't know about you, but this is what I have to say. And what happened was he smacked me <laughs> to the ground and I got mad. I got super mad. So I was only seven, so I didn't really know how to fight. So I was just punching his leg because I was pretty short at the time. And that's whenever I kicked him in the nuts. And that's whenever <laughs> he got on the ground. I didn't know that was his weak spot, but then turns out it's everybody's weak spot, so I just decided to do it. And my brother looked at him in the ground, and then he just swung, and he started a massive fight. Another guy in the audience, because it was like a circle pit, another guy in the audience was having an argument to see like what started all this. So they were arguing back and forth, and they started punching, and everybody started punching, and everybody turns, everybody in the circle pit turns out they were fighting each other back and forth, and I was still here on the ground, still crying. And, you know, in tears. But then again, I was happy at the same time. Because my brother was going to town on him. Seriously. But the Halloween party was great. <laughs> After that, we really didn't do much. He took me trick-or-treating still. But I really didn't get that much candy because I had a black eye right here. I, I had a black eye. Just to say. Yeah. And... Just to let you know, if you guys haven't seen any of my videos, and I have a, a blue like vein right here. It's only because that's the reason why it's there. I got slapped like super freak. Like at the moment, I thought it wasn't really that hard. Then he slapped me super freaking hard. And whenever my mom went to come pick us up, that's whenever <laughs> I started to feel it more. So I saw this blue vein started coming out of my eye, and I looked in the mirror. I'm like, maybe this will go away. Well, it turns out. I've been having it ever since, so that's just the way it is, you know. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, sorry if it's kind of a rush story time. I just want to do something cool for Halloween so I can show you guys what I was trying to say. But anyway, guys, if you like the video, like it. Rev out. Peace.